BC. Call the ball 
as soon as you know it's yours. So you're real good in service seed, but you didn't take no notes, right? Mm. That's kind of what that, you real good in service seed. We get out there, okay. Call the ball as soon as you know it's yours. Why did I say as soon as you know it's yours? Why didn't I just put call the ball? Uh, it might have been somebody else's fault. Why did I say call the ball as soon as you know it's yours? Why did I add that? So you don't run into somebody, number one. If I call the ball, it tells everybody else, get out of the way. Number two, it increases, it increases my success with this pass because that means I was there, stopped, platform out, shoulder drop, and ready. It increases my chances of passing the target. I saw it early, I was there, stopped, down low, early and ready. All of that ups my chance of passing a good ball. Calling it late means I move late, which means there's a chance I'm still moving, ball gets shanked left to right. All of that increases my chance of passing a good ball. Now, let me give you guys a goal for how soon I want you to call it. Call the ball. Somebody claim the ball, claim the ball before it crosses the net. Someone needs to claim the ball before it crosses the net. Write that down. Somebody needs to claim the ball before it crosses the net. So now you got a target. So here's what's going to happen. Is everybody going to be able to do that? No, but that's what you're working toward. You're working toward being able to call the ball before it crosses the net, knowing that it's yours. Now let's talk through some scenarios. What if you call the ball and it kind of veers off like a float does, and it goes a little bit into so-and-so's area? What do you think you should do? A, she said, let them get it. Give me another option. Two, she said, you should still go. She said, three, tell them that they should go. You can say help. That's the same thing. Good. Here's why. I'm going to tell you why I think, what I think is the most effective. You decide. My choice is that you still go. You still go. And the better you get at reading, you stop calling balls that are on yours. I don't think you have enough time to say help. I think it causes people to go into a panic, and if you're in a loud gym, help to sound like anything. I've been in gyms that are packed, and they're like, I was saying help. They're like, I didn't hear you. Ooh, I couldn't understand what you were saying. You still go. It ventures you into their lane. And, but here's the deal. If the other person is engaged, they're watching you. They can see you called it. They see you tracking it, then they should get out of your way. Will you bump somebody? Yes. Should you be laying somebody out and they be really injured? You shouldn't. <laughs> We're just not moving that fast and